Good day everyone. In this tutorial, we are going to learn how to fix Wi-Fi not showing in Windows 11, especially after update. So you have updated your Windows and suddenly the Wi-Fi is missing or Wi-Fi is not working. Follow this tutorial and we will be only doing three simple steps to fix this problem. So let's get started. So here, click on the search icon and type File Explorer. File Space Explorer and you'll find the file explorer so once it is opened at the left hand side we need to click on this pc and i will click on that and then we need to go to c drive now here in c drive we need to go to this windows folder and then we are looking for software distribution folder so I'll just do a double click on that and here under download section select all and click on shift delete so in this manner you are clearing the space and we are also fixing this Wi-Fi issue after update in Windows 11 so once this is done we will move to the next step and the next step is to do the right click in the start icon and then go to device manager now once the device manager is open i'll just maximize it here we are looking for a network adapters and you will find it right below the monitor and i will click on that and look for anything which says wireless so in my case i have uh, intel wireless in your case you might have amd or a different manufacturer wireless adapter so the process the steps will remain same for all manufacturers just do a right click and click on update driver and then click on search automatically for drivers if you do not find it then go to file i'm sorry go to action and click on scan for hardware changes and then look for your wireless adapter and even after updating you don't uh, get any option then just do a right click again and click on update driver click on browse my computer for drivers and here i'll select let me pick from a list of available drivers and select the first one let's see if that works and then select the second one if that works for you you just need to select that and click on next and it will install and see if that works for you all right so once this is done restart the computer and see if that works for you all right and the last and the third very important step is to click on the i mean do a right click in the start icon and then click on run and type services dot msc like this once you have typed it click on okay this will work on windows 10 as well because the steps which i'm following can be done almost all version of windows that's the best part so here once your services are open opened click any of uh, the services and press w and then look for wlan auto config so i'll scroll down i have find it you will find wlan auto config just do a right click go to properties and see the startup type if it's manual or disabled select automatic all right and click on apply and then okay and also do a right click and if you see start or restart active then just click on restart or start all right so once it is done in this manner we have successfully refreshed the wi-fi services now we just have to restart the computer and go come here and try to connect your wi-fi and i'm sure your issue will be fixed do let me know in the comment section if this steps if these steps fixed your problem i'll be glad if you hit the like and subscribe and please do leave a comment i'll see you in the next tutorial and also do let me know if that doesn't work i'll tell you a few more steps to do all right so have a great day goodbye